Hello everyone, I'm going to do one last zombies trophy here for you. This is called the Doctor's Inn. You got to use the PhD slider to fall 10 feet and kill 10 enemies at once. Now, for some reason, it is the rarest zombies trophy in the game. So I'm going to show you how to get it. You can get it solo pretty easily. Now, I'm going to do this on the Blood of the Dead map. You can do it on any of the maps. It doesn't matter. Now, the perks... It's very important that you equip in the fourth slot the PhD slider. When you build up a charge, you can slide into an enemy to trigger an explosion. With the modifier, it'll increase the explosive damage when going into a slide from a greater height. So it's very important that we put the PhD slider in the fourth slot. Now you'll notice it's not available until level 42. So the workaround is you can use the secret sauce. That'll uh, give you one random perk when you use that machine. Now you also have to have all four perks active when you go for this trophy. You need the modifier for the PhD slider. You also want monkey bombs, especially if you're doing this solo. You can get those from mystery boxes or go to CD Street and you'll see that little monkey statue there. If you use a level two or greater special weapon, when you kill enemies or zombies around that monkey, you'll see those little blue orbs go to the monkey. And then once the head glows red, after you get enough kills, you shoot it. You can then go back to the spawn room where you first start the game and in the basement here is going to be a set of monkey bombs for you and get for free. So now with the monkey bombs equ equipped, I'm going to go and purchase all of the perks. You need, again, have all four active at the same time when you get this trophy. So the first one is going to be right outside the powerhouse. We are then going to go up through the third floor of the cell block, go into the infirmary, and then go to the back here to find the second perk machine. Remember, you need to have the PhD slider in the fourth slot with all four perks active at one time in order to get this trophy. So there's the infirmary. We're gonna go through the Citadel tunnels now, and we're gonna head over the, to the docks bridge. Find our another perk machine. And now we're gonna go find the tonic machine. This is gonna be in the warden's office. It's gonna cost you 2,500 points if you have secret sauce, and it's gonna give you a random perk. Now, it's not going to give me PhD slider right away, so I'm going to do it again. It's still not going to give it to me, so I'm going to go flip some rounds. I'm going to go to the cafeteria. I find to be the safest place to do it. And finally, by round 15, I have enough points and finally get the PhD slider. You'll see it flashing down there. Now, when it's flashing, that means you have a charge. If you don't have a charge, you have to just slide to build up the charge. Now, with all four perks, with the PhD slider... In the modifier active, I'm going to go out to the powerhouse because there's a nice long set of stairs here. I have 373 kills, so what I'm going to do is place my monkey bomb at the bottom of the stairs to group up the zombies. I'm going to go to the top of the stairs and then sprint to the top and jump in a sprint. you got to make sure you sprint, jump, and in the middle of my jump, I'm going to hold the slide button and hold the slide button throughout the entire process. So sprint, jump and then slide and keep holding that slide button until you land and destroy all the zombies. You can see I killed 20 zombies in that attempt. So just to recap, if you're gonna do this solo, make sure you get a set of monkey bombs, whether you get it from the box or you get it from the monkey statue. Get all four perks, have all of them active at one time in the PhD slider in the fourth spot and then Eventually, the trophy will pop. It took a couple minutes, so I just kind of gave myself up here in the powerhouse. And lucky for me, the trophy popped. It just took, it takes a long time. You don't have to kill yourself. You just have to wait. So thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe.